Wind Waker is the greatest game of all time. Preach it, brother. Preach that shit. <laughs> <laughs> all right. You know what's funny? A hurricane was actually talking to me about uh, doing a Wind Waker uh, Let's Play. Oh, yeah, he was? Yep. Okay, interesting. By the way, this, oh, this yes. probably just ruined it for him. <laughs> yeah, hey, audience, how's it going? Um, We should probably address you or something. So... We don't have Twilight Princess right now because Tob Paz emulator and whatever ROM he has of it, or I don't know if ROM's the word or ISO, I don't fucking know what type of file it is. Point is, it runs like shit and we're waiting until Twilight Princess HD comes out. And I really don't want to play Majora's Mask for incredibly obvious reasons if you've watched literally any of the videos except for maybe the first two where we <laughs> were having fun. Uh, we're just gonna play Wind Waker, and this first session, we're just gonna dick around and have a good time, because frankly, we haven't done that with games. That Zelda. is the as the essence of Wind Waker. Yeah, that we're just makes gonna like run so around. enjoyable. Is just you can play the game without focusing at all on the story. Yeah. And it's still enjoyable, like just walking around this beautiful world and just listening to the soundtrack and the. The sound effects with the waves in the background. Oh, man, I'm almost afraid, like, it's like we're starting off so positive. I'm almost afraid it's gonna be like a Majora's Mask situation. <laughs> and that's not possible because this is Wind Waker. <laughs> that is true. You know what? <laughs> you spoke the truth. You spoke the truth, my good friend. Majora's M Mask is a piece of fucking shit compared to Wind Waker. <laughs> As a game, yeah. Like, I, Wind I don't... Waker makes everything seem like a piece of fucking shit. I mean, I don't take back what I said about like Majora's Mask being like conceptually brilliant. It's got great ideas, but oh, like... Oh, yeah, it's, it's got yeah. great ideas. Don't get me wrong. But, I mean, you know, we had I to... think it's a brilliant game. It's we, just... We just had to fucking play it, is yeah. the thing. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that's the problem. That's the, that's, therein lies the issue. All right, man. Now this is the name I'm going with, and when we come to certain moments, uh, it should it should make sense. It might get old, but you know what? I think I think uh, I think maybe the longer it goes on, the funnier it'll be. Who knows? It could go either way. Mm -hmm. I mean, even Slave got old time. This is but one of the legends of which the people speak, and you can't skip it, Xana. The other legends are like kind of shit, so we're gonna go with this one. There's other ones, but you don't really want to hear them. <laughs> You're gonna find it interesting what I come came up with. With one of uh, them involves horse porn. Unless you are into that. So anyways, there was like a golden magical nacho chip where someone like cut out the middle of it and it was surrounded- I, I, think, I, I think I've heard that one on an abridged series one time. Oh, the nacho thing? I- oh, wow, I didn't know that one. I, I, maybe it was a Dorito. I don't know. Well, I guess Gen was like really hungry because he's like, I want to eat that fucking nacho chip, bro. <laughs> and I will kill everyone to get that nacho chip. I'd like to think that all the guys passed out were at like a party and they had like nachos and, and booze and shit and they all passed out and Gen is like, haha, the last chip is mine. <laughs> None of you still have the chips. But little did he realize, Link's like, that's my chip, motherfucker, and he <laughs> he didn't actually kill him, he just kind of held the sword upwards awkwardly, and Ganon's like, ah, it's really shiny, and then he threw the chip over his head. And then, like, the the chip was, what the fuck is Cody even talking about in the background there? I don't know. I think he's trying to sound black or something. <laughs> <laughs> so, so anyways, the the... Nacho chip was surrounded by other tinier black nacho chips, and Link was confused, so he left. And all the people <laughs> turned into stick men for some reason. And uh, uh, anyways, as I was saying, uh, the idea I've come up with for like the intro to my Wind Waker bridge, I'm not gonna say it here, but I think you're gonna enjoy it, Xana. Okay. Yeah. No, it'll if, be. If everything goes right, it's going to be enjoyable. It'll be a good time, man. It'll be a good time. I fucking love Wind Waker. <laughs> <laughs> I. You know what? Like, I. I couldn't tell. Can I, can I can I tell you about my experience with just this intro when I first played Wind Waker? Go go nuts go nuts, buddy. Every when I saw this intro and they started talking about the about the Hero of Time and whatnot. I'm like, holy crap! This is the sequel to Win to Ocarina of Time that I've been waiting for. I mean, it wasn't Majora's Mask that I was waiting for as a sequel because at the end of Ocarina of Time, Ganondorf is not killed or defeated; he's sealed away. Yeah, And he's yeah. talking about, I will rain terror upon your descendants. And I'm thinking to myself, when I first played that game and got to that part, and I'm thinking to myself, oh, there's going to be a sequel to this game. Then Majora's Mask comes out and has nothing to do with Ganondorf or anything. And I'm like, oh, this isn't what I was waiting for. Yeah, yeah. And then Wind Waker comes out and this happens and it tells you, you know, oh, by the way, that didn't hold Ganon. He actually came back. And it's like, oh, shit. Like, I didn't actually say that because I was 12, but still. 
Yeah, yeah. I don't remember how old I was, but what yeah, I'm like, of? this is it. This is the sequel I was waiting for. <laughs> and then at the end of the game, you actually do kill Ganondorf. Like, he loses the Triforce of Power, and you shove a sword into his skull. Yeah. It's like, yes! Right down the parietal yes! lobe, my friend. Right down the fucking, like, top of that shit. I'm like, this is the game I was waiting for since Ocarina of Time. It, it was perfect in every way. <laughs> Well, per it, it, we'll it's see. what I was waiting for for so long. It has a beautiful art style. It's enjo it at its soundtrack is just Oh, I mean, a, ver it's so a very soothing to listen to the soundtrack. Like the reason <laughs> I picked the that specific uh song for yeah. my uh, birthday video yeah. is because I think it is one of the most relaxing and soothing songs I've ever heard. <laughs> I just have that on and I can just I just I just veg, dude. Tell me how you tell me how you really feel, buddy. <laughs> Damn. Okay, yeah, I didn't I didn't expect such enthusiasm from you, but I guess that'll make for a good a good playthrough. Because it's fucking Wind Waker. Wait, Sorry. Chipsa. Ha! There we go. <laughs> that was Big T. That was Big T's joke, but I just felt the need yeah, to. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I was trying to kill a bug. That's when. Big brother. Hey, fag. <laughs> I didn't notice that she had little seagulls on the the telescope. Oh yeah. Yeah. I know that design. Ah uh, quite... man, Grandma fucking lit it, made him sleep outside again. I suppose. <laughs> I see every yeah, an embarrassment to the family, Link. <laughs> I almost froze to death last night. I'm weak. You got clothes, don't you? <laughs> Those will keep you warm now. Get out. <laughs> I knew you'd be here. I've been wa- like, Link. Look on her face when you said that. Like, I knew you'd be here. Yeah, Link's like- With Whoa. just those dead black eyes. <laughs> <laughs> this is my favorite spot to gaze at, see? When I, when I play with the gulls, I call it Errol's Lookout. So I actually- you, just, you took an, a building and named it something. And now, th that's what it's going to be called from now on. I basically own it. Like, I actually legally own the property rights to this specific building. Where'd you, you get the money? I cut grass for a living. Oh, that would do it. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> Dude, like, lawn mowing must be, like, the greatest fucking business in this universe. Like, the most oh, lucrative. I, I would love that, because I like lawn mowing, so... Like, who needs tips when you can mow fucking lawns, you know? Yeah, just mow the grass. So, Link's trespassing on private property, and he's probably gonna get, uh... uh Prosecutor to the fullest extent of the law, I assume. These seagulls are all my employees. <laughs> they will tear. They you. will take you out. They will tear <laughs> your ass sing, up. Just a single word from me, and they will tear you apart. Do you remember what day it is today, buddy? Remember what day it is? The day you pay me. <laughs> what protection Dude. money? Protection yeah. money. There you go. <laughs> You're still half asleep, aren't you? Did you forget? Today is Adolf Hitler's birthday! <gasps> How could I forget? Our lord and savior! <laughs> Heil! <laughs> Heil Hitler. That's why Graham's been waiting for you to come back to the house. She's been waiting for a while now, and you know how she gets Where is that shitty piece of crap? <laughs> yeah, like, she started smashing plates and shit. It's real bad in there. Like, I'm not just concerned for, like... My safety, but for like the safety of like the neighborhood. <laughs> you should probably go home, like right now. You gotta hurry up, dude. You're, there's like a fucking ticking clock on this shit. A bomb's about to go off. And you're the bomb squad. Alright, man. Oh, fuck. Oh, there we go. What a thrill. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't resist. <laughs> Snake eater. <laughs> uh, you never, you can never think of ladders the same way again, can ya? You know? No, I can't. I can't. I was actually even considering putting that in my episode. Just having that is what a thrill. And Link's Stop like, it. what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Who dat? <laughs> oh, dude, don't pass the pig guy. 
He has so much to offer you. Pigman? Where's the pigman? He's over here. Hey, pigman. It's a wild... Wild pig! Ooh, see? Look! That black one there! Don't you see him? We need to kill the black! <laughs> this is perfect! My wife was just telling me how she really wanted a pet! These are literally the only animal here, so we kind of had to narrow it down, the pig. Although I think... That or seagulls. Yeah. I don't know, I think pigs are kind of cute, though. Pigs are too alert about their surround... Uh, I must be around farm pigs too much. <laughs> <laughs> they are not the most alert creatures. There's more... Mm, what? <laughs> Excuse me while I roll around my own dung. <laughs> Hey, it keeps you cool. Come on, man. Don't yeah, knock it. They, don't knock they, it till you try it. They, they can't sweat, so. <laughs> don't knock it till you try it, buddy. If you want to get close to one, you have to hold R to crouch and tilt. I don't even know what I'm saying right now. You can see it too, can't you? <laughs> the fourth wall. I see it everywhere. I guess, could, I guess you could also distract it with bait. Yeah. It's that too. But fuck it. He's so cute when he crawls around! Yeah. <laughs> it's the cutest thing! It is cute. I'm gonna get ya. I'm gonna get ya, piggy. He's a little piggy. He's a good little piggy. He's a good little piggy. This little piggy went to market. You can't this, see me? I'm this sneaking. This little piggy, yeah, Drew Speed. He doesn't give a fuck. But if I stand up, all of a sudden. He still doesn't give a fuck. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it takes him a second. Yeah. It's still hard to get catch the fuck. him, though. How did you do that? <laughs> it's How really, did you do that? It's really hard to catch him, though. What the fuck? <laughs> I can never do that. Where are you going? I don't know. I just ran at him and caught him. Hey, get I got a pig. <laughs> if I get rid of the pig. No, don't... I'll bet. Is he, like, allergic to fucking pigs or something? Is that his... He is wouldn't run at me until is, I threw- He wouldn't run at me until I threw the pig. Is pig his repellent? Let's try this. Fuck. Wait. How are you- I don't know, I just- I always try to do that, it never works! Damn, it doesn't work, wait. Well, he just hit- Oh, I see what it is. You just hate the black pig, don't you? <laughs> A little fucking racist on our hands, huh? It's not nose little racist. <laughs> <laughs> Wanna take it out on that pig? Hey, oh yeah, I love I love how he like looked like he was running away when I picked up the rock. He's like, <laughs> he's like, hey, I'm gonna never mind. <laughs> I'm already loving this way more than Majora's Mask right now. Yep. Ah, uh, all right, let's just see what. Wait, 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 wait. wait. What? You gotta talk to the lady. She tells you about pot. Oh, dude, I gotta tell you because my supplier man totally ran out. Hey, sexy lady! Oh, uh, you. Uh, happy <laughs> birthday! <laughs> hey, did your sister Errol find you? She was supposed to tell you that your grandmother is looking for you. Speaking of your sister, she saw me at work the other day and she said she wanted to learn to carry jars on her head like me so she could help your grandma with chores. That is the sweetest thing ever. Aww, that's adorable. <laughs> Everything in this game is adorable. I like how you follow that up with a... <laughs> yep. <laughs> um, so if you see her, tell her that all she has to do is stand in front of a jar and press A to carry it and press the jar down, she has to press R. Why I... didn't you tell her this when she asked you? Uh. <laughs> Can you tell her that for me? <laughs> I. I guess she was too. I guess she was. Oh, never mind. I was gonna say she was too distracted by the fact that she didn't have a nose, but she does. It's just hidden. Mm -hmm. Lots of these characters are like that. Yes. <clears throat> I like it, man. It's a timeless. It's a timeless visual style. It looks. Looks oh yeah, it just looks as amazing. nice. Hold on, first. Fuck yes. your kitchen, bitch! <laughs> I love doing that. Hold on. That. Oh, what the? Sorry, I was having some problems with the wall there. How do I get around wall? It's a thrill. What? <laughs> <laughs> Why does that keep happening? <laughs> 
Hey, you little shit! Put this on and sweat for me! I've been waiting for you... Uh... You. You? Uh, you... Try these on. As you can tell, like... He's just been living in her house his whole life, and she's like, Ah, oh, shit's on the tip of my fucking tongue. <laughs> Leslie. No. <laughs> Fuck. I don't know. Shit. <laughs> Time certainly flies. I already you want to voice the grandma. I've been doing everybody so far. <clears throat> Let me get some water here first. <coughs> Hydrate. Oh. Fill yourself with the waters of life. Time certainly flies. I can't believe you're all, you're already old enough to wear these clothes. You just can't wait for me to die, can you? No, no, we can't. <laughs> what? He's selling chocolate. What? <laughs> chocolate. Uh, 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 so warm clothes in summer. They look like they might be a little... You were complaining about the code last night, motherfucker! <laughs> what do you want? Oh, man. I just love that disappointed look on his oh. face. That, that's another thing about this game. When I got to this point of the game, I was like, yeah, I understand that look. Your your birthday present is clothes. Yeah. I, understand, I understand that pain. That's some, that. that's some relatable... You know, no matter who you are... Well, unless you unless you're so poor you don't have clothes. Never mind. It doesn't matter who you are. But if you are in the <laughs> if you are in the middle like so of the socioeconomic bracket in the first world, that is a shitty gift. <laughs> middle or higher, any lower than that, you probably appreciate the clothing. Cause you know. <clears throat> fucking poor people. <laughs> fucking <laughs> fucking poor. Goddamn, motion ass pieces of shit. <laughs> Don't look so disappointed, dear one. Dear one? Who called? Oh, whatever. Just try them on. Get changed right in front of Grandma. <laughs> oh, yeah. Today she is a day. She smokes celebrate. a cigarette. Yeah. Granny <laughs> likes it like that. <laughs> Take it off real slow. Oh, we just took this to a horrible place. Yeah, this, I know, but this, this is... innocently beautiful game, but you know that? That's what we do. This is a Topper Pals playthrough. people love it when we do that. Oh, so. of course. The cartoon, the cartoon, cartoony innocence warrants such darkness. Of course. That's that's what makes it so, so wonderful. Today's a day to celebrate, sweet cheeks. <laughs> you sounded like Dr. Girlfriend. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. It's the day that you'll become the same age as the young hero spoken of in all the legends. Do what you will want with me. <laughs> I uh, never even considered that. Really? Yeah, yeah. Never even thought about that. Well, I won't beg. <laughs> you only have to wear them for one day. So don't look so down. Be proud, child. Enjoy your one-day present. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday. Here's clothes, but you only have them for one fucking day. Don't worry. I'm sure that won't be a trend. Here, brother, have this telescope for one day. What the fuck? This is the shittiest birthday. <laughs> fuck all of you people. I mean, I know you're giving me clothes, but if you're going to give me clothes, at least let me keep them. <laughs> In the olden days, this was the day boys were finally considered to be men. Oh yeah. <laughs> they were taught the ways of the sword to prepare them for battles with their enemies. And by that I mean sword play. And by that I mean touching dicks. You know, the ancient Greeks used to fucking wrestle naked and covered in oil. Have that you was... heard about them Spartans? You know, they would call them their shield mates. Yeah, there was a reason they had the word mate in there. I'm not even joking. That Lots of fucking. No, <laughs> ho actually, no homo, actually though, actually. Is something that they did in Spartan. Oh, no, it was. It was. They were. They would pair I off. I was like, you're my shield mate. Now bend over. <laughs> yeah, although from what I recall, it was actually, it was uh, poor. It was bad to be considered the bottom of the mates, but somebody had to be. And that was the, yeah. that was the unfortunate thing. It was an inevitability. One of them had to be the bottom bitch. 
but that guy was like, ah, oh, you're the bottom bitch, fuck you, ha, huh? that's totally fucking faggot, ha. Huh? <laughs> By the way, <laughs> fun thing about uh, Spartan weddings. Yeah. The bride would have her head shaved and be dressed as a man, and that was her bridal gown. You remind me of my squad mates. Yeah, that is exactly the reason that they dressed them like that. If that's if that is if that has turned out to be true, that's awesome. <laughs> that is true. That's, that is that the is, reason. That is, truth, that is totally true. Truth is stranger and oftentimes funnier than fiction. Yep. Ah, uh, those Greeks, right, Xana? Xana? Uh -huh. Xana? <laughs> Xana? <laughs> Greeks are the fucked Greek up, motherfucker. I am. I am pretty. I mean. That's the problem with being Greek. You got all, you got like fuck tons of body hair, but like really small dick, and it really <laughs> sucks, man. It really, it's, it's really unfortunate. Excuse me. You can grow like a sweet beard, but like you know, but then you take yeah, off that's, the pants. That's the thing about about Greeks. Every time I, like, I saw the a movie called the Odyssey, and all of the the older Greeks all had these. Awesome epic beards. I'm like, yeah, these man. guys have some kick-ass beards. I know, man. That's why I'm like, that's why I got this shit, man. I mean, I don't want it to grow any longer because then it would get unmanageable. But like, I mean, I, I, I have the fucking like, you know, I have the fucking DNA for that shit, man. It's in my blood. The beard yep. is in my blood, man. Nowadays, I suppose. Nowadays, I suppose Orca is the only one on the island who still knows anything about sword play. You should go hang Nobody out with Nobody jacks him. off anymore. <laughs> There's no substitute for a good sword in your hand. <laughs> no substitute. <laughs> None. <laughs> I tried a bitch once. No substitute. <laughs> Hanging the family shield on the wall as decoration is another tradition that has been carried down from those days. You would know this, having lived in part of this civilization for a long period of time, but, you know, audience. Hey, so. Grandma, why is there a demon on the shield? Uh... The less questions you ask. Does all this make sense to you? Uh, that didn't even answer my question. Shut up, you were naked in front of me for the a less, little while. <laughs> the less questions you ask... <laughs> The less bruises your ass gets. <laughs> you understand that? <laughs> That's right, you do. 